Welcome back. Now, the Democratic Alliance, that's the DA, and the radical leftist economic freedom fighters, EFF, have said they will not form coalition governments in two key municipalities, Johannesburg and Shwane. A DA party executive also explained that the EFF opted to refrain from going into coalitions with either the DA or the ruling ANC party due to their different ideologies. Local reports also say the EFF will make an announcement on its stance today. And analysts are saying that the failure to reach alliances in the two municipalities, which includes the capital Pretoria, could actually lead to policy paralysis and dampen investor confidence in two of the country's economic hubs. Joining us now from Johannesburg is the uh, Channels TV South Africa Bureau Chief, Betty Dibia. Betty, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you, Cynthia. Now, Betty, has the EFF actually made any announcement as regards the coalition that was anticipated? Yes, uh, yes earlier today, the, the EFF announced that there will be no coalition mm -hmm. uh, because um, they, they didn't find common ground with the DA, uh, which was the main party, uh, uh, the DA as well as, as, as the EFF. But they will vote for the DA on issue by issue basis. So probably with the percentage that they have in a place like Swami, 11.63%, adding that to the DA, if they vote for the DA, of course you have the DA um, uh, leading or, or then electing a mayor. We, we understand after that announcement, we, 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 the, the Swami government now uh, announced that there will be on Friday. Friday we expect them to elect a speaker and then elect a mayor in that council. Okay. So there will be no coalition, but that they will support different parties depending on the place. In okay. the case of KwaZulu-Natal, they will be supporting the Nkata Freedom Party, that's the IFP. But okay. for, for Gauteng, we have three metros, big municipalities, they will be supporting the DA, but there is no coalition. Well, Betty, analysts are predicting that a failure to reach uh, um, 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 alliances in the two municipalities, which also includes Pretoria, could actually lead to policy paralysis and also dampen investor confidence in the, in the country's economic well, hubs. Uh, do you perceive that it will get to that point? I do not think so. Uh, uh, the, the EFF actually reacted to that as well. Okay. The EFF saying that we will not, you know, um, uh, the fact that we don't have a coalition doesn't mean that we will not analyze every issue as it happens. And already when the, the DA as well has a, has a did its own announcement, it's in coalition with four, four parties. COP, which is Congress of the People, the United Democratic um, Movement, uh, the African Christian uh, Party, as well as the Freedom Plus, uh, Freedom Hunt Plus. So he, they have coalition with, with four parties already, as well as the support of the, the EFF. So um, they, they believe that they will not, uh, according to the EFF, they will not be stopping service delivery to the people mm -hmm. or policy formulation but they will uh, uh, analyze issue by issue, and they will not be supporting the ANC. That's what they make clear. But their votes will go for the DA according to issue, on issue oh. basis. Okay. Well, but Betty, based on what, what you've been hearing and what you've also been seeing, who do you think has, which party do you think this is working out best for, this coalition um, issue? Um, for now, uh, uh, let me just put it this way. The, e the, the ANC has had the misfortune in this case of being the, the longest serving majority, I mean, of these, of these ones now, of these parties we're talking about. Mm -hmm. uh, um, it, it's been in power since the end of apartheid, and, and it had all that while to be judged. So in this case, it's lost a lot of ground, and the DA, I guess I'll say it's working out for the DA, but as one of the smaller parties, the, 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 the lady from the uh, African Christian Party, Democratic Party, mm -hmm. South Africa has won, democracy has won. She has a whole big elephant. She has the smaller parties working with the so-called bigger parties. So everybody has a voice, everybody has a say. The country wins as a whole. Okay. Well, Betty, thank you so much for bringing us up to speed. We appreciate your time as always.
I would also like to say thank you for joining us on Network Africa today. I'm Cynthia Aren.